one, smile, three. Just that, that name recognition of Blue Diamond, Turlock, Turlock, Blue Diamond, amazing. It was less than six years ago when Blue Diamond, a major almond producer, opened up shop in Turlock. I'm really excited because it's just what we've been, we hoped for when we started. But it didn't take long to outgrow their space. We are a part of uh, mainstream consumption in the U.S. now. And that same trend is happening globally uh, in Australia, in the UK, uh, in South Africa. President and CEO Mark Jansen tells us their almond breeze business is growing at 14% every year around the world. And 20% of homes now have that product in their fridge. We need to expand to support that increased consumer demand. So this is a fully integrated almond beverage line. He says the expansion will pave the way to keep up with demand make more almond milk and create a new line. All of which he says will end up bringing more jobs to town. It will create significant additional jobs in Turlock. Not only those that are employed here directly in the facility, but what we found is when we expand manufacturing, it creates jobs throughout the community that support that manufacturing. And these aren't just any jobs. The city believes these are careers that would make it through a recession. And many of these jobs start at over $20 an hour. So these are important and living wage kind of jobs that are recession resistant. The city calls Turlock the Silicon Valley of food processing. And with three major expansions set to happen at the same time, you might be able to see why. We also have Sunnyside Farms who um, actually is adding product lines um, and so between the three U.S. Cold Storage, Sunnyside Farms and Blue Diamond will be adding almost 200 new jobs to our local economy. In Turlock, Ina Howland, ABC 10 News.